Aggression is creating fear in many Ukrainian citizens. ABC 17's Leila Mitchell is live from the Mizzou campus after speaking with a Ukraine professor with ties to Mizzou. And Leila, she was able to give you an inside look into what it's like being a citizen in Ukraine right now. That's right, Chanel. And today I was able to speak with Oksana Zamora, who spent time here at Mizzou in 2018. But now she is back in Ukraine, where she says tensions are high. With tensions running high at the Ukraine border. So that's the source of the tension between Russia and, and Ukraine. I mean, the occupation of the Crimea in 2014. When Russia invaded Crimea, a time Oksana Zamora says mirrors some of the tensions in Ukraine today. It is the same, I would say, like in 2014, but much scarier because in 2014, it was uh, really difficult to understand how can it happen. But then it happened. And people start to understand that actually uh, not, there is nothing impossible. Zamora, an associate professor from Ukraine, spent six months at the University of Missouri back in 2018 as part of an exchange program. But now back in Ukraine. Currently, it's, it's very terrible to, 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 to live here mentally because uh, you understand that it's a beautiful country with nice people, with big resources. Zamora said many Ukrainians, including herself, are faced with the hard truth. People started to love being Ukrainian, you know, to be proud of that. And then you understand that any moment you can wake up or any moment you can have, you can be running away, you know, but your parents, your relatives, how you're going to save them if you're going to be saved yourself. Zamora has packed an emergency backpack, but at this time has no plans to leave. For Americans, it's okay to travel, like to study in one city, then to go to work in another city. The Ukrainians are mentally different. We are really physically and mentally tied to the place where we were born. And Zamora, like many others, is unsure if Russian will invade the country, but she says she believes that the Ukrainians will stand up and fight if that happens. Now she says there is some concern for those who cannot protect themselves, and she says what is going to happen next is all a big question. Reporting live in Columbia, Layla Mitchell, ABC 17 News. Okay, great story, Layla. For more on Oksana's experience and more on the tensions at the Ukraine border, you can visit our website at abc17news.com.